tax season has the employees at one local accounting firm working like a dog lately. So their boss decided they deserved a treat today. News 13's John Lee tells us how a smart boss found a way to bark up some morale. Seven days a week. If you work in this building. 12 to 14 hours a day. You might be hard to account for these days. It gets pretty exhausting. Melanie Johnson admits when it comes to her dependents, she's distant. They don't get to see me very much this time of year. The accounting firm Dixon Hughes Goodman is filled with anxiety, stress, and deadlines. The corporate returns are due Monday. So, you know, you've got this crunch period. Some treats down in the conference room. But from the cubicle around the corner, the email you should definitely read. Puppies to play with. How about that? Oh, they're so cute. Suddenly, the office becomes kind of a petting zoo. Yeah, this one likes to put his head up on your shoulder. Four puppies sparking a lot of conversation. What do you say? What, what do you say? Yeah. Where are you going? Where are you going? The puppy gram comes from Brother Wolf Animal Rescue. No. Michael's a partner. <laughs> the critters from the same litter lapped up the chance to break the monotony. Might go home in my pocket. I'm not sure. <laughs> I've seen people who are really in the tense trenches of tax season. Just kind of, oh. Cuddly moments so valuable they might count as income. We had a gift that we wanted oh, to give you as well. Thank you so much. So, but thank you for coming and bringing the puppies. A donation, a small price to pay for a little doggy therapy. I could just warn you that there's nothing about these dogs that are deductible. <laughs> Don't count on any of that. <laughs> Expert advice during an hour when taxes were actually the last thing on their mind. That's the greatest thing in the world. <laughs> it certainly makes a Friday better. <laughs> in Asheville, John Lee, News 13.